Hi, this is a pre-class video for blood groups. First, you need to know that what is your blood group. In the, rec in the recent experience, you might have identified your blood group at the blood bank or blood center. Now, you need to know the physiological basis of this blood group. What is the antigen or a glutinogen present on the surface of RBC membrane and what are the antibodies present? And you need to identify that in detail so that it will be an essay question in the exam. So before that we need to see the different systems like ABO system, RS system, we have 30 different systems are there in the blood groups and we need to identify them because of the essay question possibilities. Then who is the scientist behind this, who discovered blood groups? You need to come out something with the name of the scientist. Then advantages of knowing your blood group in clinical practice as well as in research, scientific research. You need to list out all these advantages and once you know this, Ultimately, you are going to use it for best advantages for blood transfusion. That is the reason why you are putting it on your ID card also. So, what are the precautions you are going to take before any blood transfusion? That you need to come prepared. Then applications, of course, we have uh, frequent glass pima question, erythroblastosis fetalis, erythroblastosis fetalis. That is mismatch between parent or mother to the child in terms of RH grouping. So, RH typing so that you need to identify this incompatibility and what are the outcomes of this mismatch that we will discuss in the class to come.